Okay. Uh, we don't have to go far, actually. Let's see, where exactly are we going? Let's see the local map. I would have thought with that building. That's the thing with uh, Oblivion. You have to make sure you use the local map every now and then. What is it, citizen? Citizen? Okay, we need to pick luck away in here. When I get to level 10, I should be able to uh, get a, an unbreakable one. Nice, first try. Okay, we need to go upstairs. I mean, they're a lock. It's an easy one, though. like breathing off accent okay I planted the ice staff in the chest in Akne's bedroom I should go see if Scriva and collect my reward okay that means we need to go to Preville but we're not going to do that we're going to go and do more then sorry the game froze there guys we're going to do more um, arena stuff So let's go back to the arena and then we'll finish off that how the guards coming back what is it citizen you have they're all on the waterfront there so let's see we need to change the map to a big map we need to go to arena Speak. let's go straight through here And we do a couple of fights in the arena. Maybe do uh, until we level up. So uh, not level, uh, not level our character up. I mean, get promo promotion in the thief skill. So we usually have to do about three fights. Some health potions would be pretty nice, though. Uh, what we like for potions, anyway. I only got one. Can I make any poisons? That'd be good too. Go to the market district. Yeah, we should stock up on potions and poisons. I'm gonna make them. Get that prize money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We will, we will. Okay, let's wait till the morning time. Let's hear it. I have everything but the budding alchemist under one roof. Thank you. Can I interest you in some of my wares? Uh, let's see your ingredients first. I'll buy some beef. Do I need venison? Try to see what does restore health. Restore magicka, damage, damage health. Most normal food and fruits do fatigue. Oh, 
Oh yeah, this stuff. Yeah, let's buy that. So technically, four gold, and we're gonna get two health potions out of that. So that's not too bad. Uh, aloe vera. I know that. Yeah, you know, let's buy some to have extra. Hey, Trickles, how you doing, buddy? Your old dog is kicking in her sleep. Moxie just looked at me and was like, wondering if she was crazy. <laughs> okay, how much are these going to cost? 900. We don't have that much. We have 300. What can we get? That should do it. Thank you. Goodbye. Good day. Morning. Get ready. Let's get to the, the arena now. Let's start ready to fight. You doing good? That's good to hear, man. Good to hear you're doing better. Citizen. All right, let's um, quickly make some potions here. Aloe vera, beef. Oh no, beef doesn't do health, does it? Good. Or meat. I did. I didn't bother to name it because it wasn't a healing potion. But I will name the uh, the healing potions rum. Okay. I think that's all the healing potions I have. I can make right now. Okay. Okay. Let's remove that. Now damage health. That's the next one we want to do. I have plenty, plenty of uh, fatigue. Cure disease, no. Here, damage health. Damage health, nice. What should I name the damage health ones? Any names in mind? Just call it death. Damage health. And add any extra to this. Protect life, no. Burden. Burden's always good, it slows them down. Strawberries damage health, that's crazy. This one be called slow death. Cause it slows them down. I'm definitely gonna be using this. Ah, oh, let me change it.
Okay, let's make the last few. So, three points damage for 13 seconds, which isn't too bad. They'll get stronger and better as we go on. Alright, let's go in. You like that? Alright, so we need to change in your equipment. How is our sword doing damage wise? It's a little worn down. Oh, I need to sell that silver. Um, silver Warhammer. We can just repair it. Yeah, we need to get journeyman. Let's talk to the Great Prince. So he's the leader. He's the the grand champion of the arena. Hail, friend! I don't believe I've ever seen you down here on the Bloodworks. And we haven't spoke to him yet. So allow me to introduce myself. My name is Agranok Gromalag. Most people just call me the Great Prince. It's kind of silly, I know, but the people of Cyrodiil need heroes. I'm more than happy to oblige. Ah, so you're an arena combatant. It's always good to meet a fellow warrior, especially one who isn't here just to kill the Grand Champion. <laughs> kill the Grand Champion? I'm the reigning Grand Champion of the arena, you see. Once you become a champion, you'll need to challenge me for my title. It's a fight to the death, so if you've progressed that far and want a shot at the Grand Championship, you'll have to try and kill me. That does look like a Grand Champion's haircut. Yeah, he's got pretty awesome hair. The Grey Prince. Yes, it's what everyone calls me. I guess I'm partly to blame. I have never made it a secret that I'm actually only half orc. I am a lord's son, yet I've been denied the noble privilege to which I'm entitled. So I have become the Grey Prince, noble in my own right. Still, if I could prove who I really am and show the world that an orc can be noble in blood as well as deed, maybe, yes, you could help me. It looks like a samurai haircut. <laughs> like Shrek and uh, Samurai ha came together, right? Uh, sorry, I can't help you right now. Yeah, yeah, we'll help him. I actually want to do this quest and it's for particular reasons why and... Uh, when it's happening, I'll explain why. But we're just going to say, yes, I may be able to help you. Tell me more. I grew up here in the Imperial City, but I was born elsewhere. My mother was a servant in the employ of Lord Leviticus and resided at his fortress. Lady Leviticus was a shrew of a woman. The Lord and my mother grew close and ultimately fell in love. I was the result of their union. When the lady learned of my birth, she was furious and threatened to kill both my mother and me. So we fled, leaving my claim to nobility behind. Please, go on. Let's be nice to him. My mother died recently. Before she passed, she gave me this key and told me it would unlock the truth at the place of my birth, Crowhaven. Crowhaven is a ruined fort far to the west of here. I'd go myself, but my training regiment doesn't allow for the luxury of such an excursion. My friend, you must travel to Crowhaven and use the key to unlock whatever it is that holds the proof of my birthright. Find this proof and return it to me, and I'll share with you some of my finest combat techniques. Trust me. You can't learn these moves in a book. There we go. <laughs> Jack knows noble uh, noble means money. Of course. He's nice to him. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's get her. Hey, what time is it? Okay, we're in the right time. You made it to blood letter. Which is more than I can say for most people who step into that arena. Keep it up. Wait, we can talk about someone? Auntie Svenian? 
That name sounds familiar. Something to do with the Arcane University. Most wizards live somewhere in the Imperial City. Oh. Alright, I'm ready for a match. The next opponent is a Red Guard. I've seen him fight with both a mace and a sword. So be ready for either one. Not gonna make a difference to us. Well, let's get fighting. Okay. So I've got three rums, a couple poisons, I've got two slow deaths here and ten deaths. Some healing potions and I've got some brandy for stamina. So we're pretty good. And my weapon's all repaired. Let's go. Got a quick save. And there we go. All right, let's start with a slow death. The Imperial City. Welcome to the arena. There's nothing better than watching two eager bloodletters fighting to the death for fame and glory. But enough talk. Let the battle begin. All right, so the sword. I wonder if I can disarm him. Hey, that's my move. All right, this guy, this guy hurts. All right, let's try it. Oh, we have to wait for this Yeah, this guy really hurts. Keep the, let's keep the dead on him. God damn it. Let's get this over with. Yes, yes, yes. Good, good, good. And he can heal, so that's something we gotta watch out for. He can heal, so let's go during death. Thank you, everybody. Today you see Jock Seagull winning her battle. Let's do our little uh, celebration here that we always do. <laughs> Jump on the light. Don't know why I do it, but I always do. Let's heal. That was a good fight, Bloodletter. You really showed that red guard who's boss. Here's your take. Now go clean yourself up. All right, I think we're ready for another one. I think we could do another one. Uh, let's get another fresh armor. That here. And let's change into that. This one's a bit worn. Uh, it's not even that bad. Let's store the old one. Come on, Bloodletter. Don't lose your momentum now. Keep fighting. Oh, we will. Let's go for a new round. Your next opponent wears a heavy raiment, but attacks with a short sword. She's like a heavily armored wasp and has the temper to match. Careful. Good boy, wouldn't it? I, I can picture that in my head. That's pretty cool. That's a good way to describe that character. All right. Go again. Round two. She's got a shield too. You left the poster behind them? Yeah. Imperial City. Welcome to the arena. 
just gonna shield. Oh, let's let the blood. Let's. this I like poisons this is so small <laughs> yeah all hail the combatant from the blue team Victor from the blue team leave the arena now and rest Thank you very much. Looks like the art from the old arena game. It, it is. They but they changed it, right? So I'll show you now. It technically is taken from the original game. Because the old game was the first ever Elder Scrolls game is called Arena. But uh go look up the old arena game cover. It has like a half naked girl in it, and that's why they had to change it. Okay, so you killed the Brecken. Don't get a big head. Here's your payout. Duck should have a dagger in his left hand. Isn't that how pirates fought? Unfortunately, we can only fight one-handed. You can't du duel weapons in, in Oblivion. Alright, uh... I think we're doing pretty good. I think we're good for another one. Maybe just we hit a save here, just in case. My red room got its paint job from fighters like you. After you disemboweled the next idiot, I want you to smear his blood all over the walls. <laughs> right, I'm ready. Next up is a dark elf. I've never seen him fight before, but he's got a bow as well as a sword. So be ready for a ranged attack. Okay. <laughs> what that means is we're going to be doing a lot of running. That's just wrong, as in the poster. Good people of the Imperial City, welcome to the arena. Just look at the yellow team's dark elf. You can see the murder in his eyes. Oh yeah, two hands. I know, right? Even hope to survive. Let's find out. Okay, going for a boat. Arena alive. My shooty are dumbass. That's the best you can do. All right, let's go for let's slow it. And let's go back up and use death on them again. And that's it then. Should be fairly easy. Easy. All hail the combatant from the blue team. Did I earn it? Did I earn it? Leave the arena now and rest. You earn it. Oh thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy I earned it. You earned it. Dink. Number one. <laughs> Jock is number one. Work bloodletter, or should I say Myrmidon? Myrmidon. That's right, you've risen in rank. You know how it works. More blood, more gold. Here. Nice. Okay. I said I'll do it. I do the arena until I got to my next level up. So we're going to um, leave the arena and continue on with more quests. So we're going to go to... And that's where today's episode is going to end today, guys. I hope you're enjoying this series of Jock. Uh, Seagull or Captain Jack Seagull 
Uh, I've been enjoying it so far. We're getting further and further into the series. A lot more to come, guys. We're doing this live on Twitch every Sunday at 10.30 p.m. The link is down in the description below. If you want to follow me on Twitch and catch it live. If you want to catch the actual live series, or if you're enjoying just watching it in a smaller section, uh, cut down on YouTube. Uh, drop comments, drop uh, likes, and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. Don't forget to hit the bell notification to get notified when each video is going up. And uh, we also do plenty of live streams here too, guys. So don't forget to uh, come join in, chat, get to know us. And uh, join the Discord if you guys really want to join the uh, Elder Irish community. Hope you guys enjoy it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.